This one I call a 2, 4, 6 bow because that's the size of the pieces, 2, 4, and 6 inches. And it's a little bit more formal than some of them. And you're going to need some glue dots for this one. And all you do is put a glue dot right in the center and make a loop. Fold that over. I just lost my glue dot. There it is. And you're just going to make, that's the six inch piece of ribbon. This works well with um, some of the three quarter inch ribbons that we have. And we're going to do the same, make a loop with the four inch piece. Just fold that over, put a glue dot in the center, and another one. And once you have your two loops made, I'm going to stick them together. And I like to have the good side of my big one down and the good side of my little one up, just so that it kind of hides the raw edges if, um, if my um, other piece slips. Okay, and then I'm going to turn it upside down, take another glue dot, the little two inch piece you're going to put on the back. That's right around the center. And you're going to wrap it around. And secure it with another glue dot. Then trim the ends. slide it around a little bit. Puff up your loops and that's how you make that one. Okay, here's a white version of this bow and I'll show you how to make this card. It's for a wedding and there's a pocket in there for money or a check. And I'll show you how to do that. It's stamped forever and always in um, pistachio pudding and I'm going to stamp some of the other words, happiness, memories, and what's the third one? Happiness, memories, and dream. I thought it might go good with this. And I'm going to stamp them in Versamark and then emboss them in clear. Okay, here's my card base. I scored it at three and three quarters and seven and a half. And then I'm going to take my paper trimmer and shortest side. I'm going to just cut from the fold line part way down. doesn't really matter where. And that will give us uh, a pocket for either money or a check. And so just take some snail or glue and just just glue the bottom, don't do the side. If I can get my glue to work. Yeah. Okay, I cut out an extra frame and I'm just going to put it on here so we have somewhere to sign. There, and that's your little money pocket. Okay. Now I embossed this in clear, so it's pretty subtle. on the front of the card. Now for this piece I'm going to use my blender pen and add just a little bit of light color. I should squeeze that. Test on there. So just my leaves a little bit. This is um, crisp cantaloupe. And we'll add some green in here. This is pistachio pudding.
Once you have it uh, pretty well colored, just take a tissue and rub off the excess. going to go around the line with the pistachio. I think I'll add a little bit of just on the very edges. The crisp cantaloupe again. Once you get this the way you want it, we're going to glue it onto the card. And take some snail. And I've got my ribbon cut already. So I just did the two tails. the center and we'll put our bow in the middle there.